You finally did it. You managed to rank up out of Platinum and get all the way to Diamond 1. Congratulations, dude. You deserve it. So now what are you gonna do? I'm Diamond 1. I deserve champ because I usually vs GC and best them. The rank system is bad, so I deserve to be champ and I have just better mechs. Oh, for God's sake. This is episode 2 of Sideswipe Players vs the rank they think they deserve. Diamonds vs Champions. In this video, we'll take four super confident Diamond 1 players who think they deserve Champ 1 and pit them against four actual Champ 1 players in best of three 1v1s. By the end of this video, we will know whether our Diamonds really do deserve Champ. Or if like the rank system works as it's intended to and separates players based on their skill levels and then assigns them a rank. Because you know, that would actually make sense. Our first matchup is in the India region and is between Avaka, aka Zyna, and Jackson. Avaka thinks they deserve champion because I am really good at game sense, mechanics, stalls, positioning, and overall IQ. Alright, well, let's see if uh, every single part of their game really is that good or if our champion defender can knock them down a peg. Alright, let's go. So, match number one and kickoff number one. So this is going to be really interesting to see this match up. We got prefit pancake and just a regular pancake from our diamond. Good little fast attack, overcommit from the diamond, and we got a stall chain maybe. And Jackson keeping possession here after that gold shot. Fairly panicky defense, I feel. That's good defense there though, not to overcommit. Maybe ceiling pinch, no. Okay. Ooh, we got a stall chain from the diamond. Very nice. Wow, that was close. And we got a bit of an overcommit. Jackson could have easily put that in. That's a wasted opportunity. Jackson taking possession again. He's got the advantage here. Could easily put this in. Beautiful gold shot there. Yeah, really unlucky defense there. I feel like Avaka could have just probably pancaked into that. But he was a little bit high in his goal. So, uh, yeah, he couldn't quite get to it. All right, kickoff number two. And we got offensive pancakes from both of them. And Jackson's maintained possession here. Some 50s in the corner. Ooh, bit of an overkill from Avaka. He's going to be low boost. Jackson. Ooh, that could, be, oh, that could have easily been an OG. And Jackson could easily put this in. Yes, he will. Nice. Good control there from Jackson. Avaka got possession here. Oh, he could easily put that in. That's uh, very nice. I thought he was going to miss that. I thought Jackson might get to it. But Avaka's done well to put that in, even though he missed his goal shot. All right, kick off number three. We got a closer match here. Jackson with the ceiling pitch almost. Nope. Good defense from Avaka. Oh, glad, glad Avaka got that still. He could have easily missed that. Nice gold shot there. Ooh, yeah, good defense. And he could easily put this in. No, he hasn't. Oh, okay. That could have definitely been the equalizer from our diamond. And dangerous from here. Avaka could easily put this in. Beautiful, he does. Wow, he's equalized with only five seconds left. Well done, Diamond. All right, so five seconds left and kickoff number five. Oh, lovely kickoff and beautiful gold shot from Avaka. Very nicely done. That might be the winner. Okay, we got four seconds left. Nice offensive pancake there from Jackson. He's not going to be able to put this in, is he? All it needs to do is touch the ground and Avaka will have taken the first match of three. Can Jackson still change his way into the goal? No, he can't. He does have a flip. Yeah, that's it. Good defense there from Avaka. Well done. Good game. All right, so our first match won by our diamond. Good job. Let's see if he can win our next match too or if it'll go to a third. All right, match number two in our best of three in the India region. Let's see if Avaka can win this one too. And first one's another prefix pancake from Jackson. He's got possession here. Missed his first stall, unfortunately. Ooh, got the second one. That's a bit of an overcommit from our champ. Ooh, Avaka couldn't put it in. Unlucky. Oh, nice little gold bounce there. That was beautiful. Didn't come to anything though. And Avaka's got possession. Nice stall chain there from the diamond. That's beautiful. And good, yeah, good patience from Jackson. Can he put this into the goal? He can't, unfortunately. Low boosted, Jackson's overcommitted hard. He was very low boost and he's gonna put it into his own net, yeah. So Avaka is one up with 40 seconds gone. Nice safe play from Jackson. Good stall chain, good pancake though, that was very smart. He probably can't put this in though, can he? Gold shot, lovely low gold shot, that was really nice. 
Nice pre-fit pancake from Jackson. They're working out pretty well for him. Oh, he slipped that straight over. Advocate's head. That's, that's in. That's really nice. Good job. All right. 2-1 lead. A minute left. And we get a good fake there from Jackson. That's worked out really well for him. Store chain coming. Missed up. Ooh, that was close. Good defense from Avika. We got a nice patient play. Avika's put it in. Beautiful gold chart. Jackson, another prefit pancake. Taking a leaf out of uh, Stevie's book there. Oh, that's a nice little stall play there. I don't know what Avika was doing there. He was just sitting on the ground. All right, so we got a champ lead. Thought we might get another fake there. Probably would have faked that kickoff. Nice ceiling pinch. And this is dangerous. Ooh, Avika has not put it in. Unlucky. Yeah, that's a good play from Avika to get it out of the out of the corner there. It's exactly what you want to do. Just gold shot it off the wall. Oh, he, Jackson's totally messed up. Yeah, Avika's overcommitted hard. Can Jackson put it in? No, he can't. Oh, he's done well. That was really nice. Yeah, this is going to be the this is a win. I'm lovely. That was a great play there. All right, six seconds left. Can Avika get the equalizer? He doesn't have time. He's not going to. Beautiful gold shot there from Jackson. So that'll probably be the winner. And that should pretty much do it. Yeah. And okay, Avika's got a consolation goal. Nice one, bro. So that leaves us with one game apiece. One to our diamond, one to our champ. And now we get our deciding match of the best of three. And we have a car change from Avika. He's rocking the uh, chromatic Merc there, very nice. All right, kickoff number one. We got a fake on the first kickoff from Jackson. Oh, that's a nice little flick there. He's done well. Oh, that could have been in. That was close. Gold shot. Jackson's got possession here. Nice clear, pinch clear off the back wall. I love to see them. They're so effective. All right, we got full possession here from Jackson. That is a huge overcommit from Avika. What has he done? No, he hasn't been able to double tap it. That should have been a really easy double tap there from Jackson. Another overcommit from Avika. I feel like the Merc is maybe giving him too much confidence. Should probably take this slow. Yeah, he's done well. Wow. Avika is overcommitting really hard sometimes. It's a nice gold shot finish. Yeah, the overcommits are really costing Avika, I feel. Jackson's done well to pancake on that. This could be dangerous. Yes, it is dangerous. Nice finish from Jackson. Jackson taking possession again with a stall chain. Nice pancake. Purple shot. Don't see many of them. Ooh, he could have put... I would have used a probably purple shot to put that in. All right, got possession play here from Jackson. Nice safe play again. A little bit of an overcommit from Avika. Is he going to OG? He's not. That's good. All right, Avika really needs a goal here. He's only got 11 seconds left. I don't think he's going to get it. This could be, yeah, this could be it. Third game one from Jackson. Yeah, I think that's it. GG's. Unlucky from Avika not to come away with the win there, but he's done really well. I feel like maybe he deserves, I don't know, mid-diamond. Probably doesn't deserve champ, but he's put up a really good fight anyway. GG's, guys, and good win from Jackson. Our second matchup is in the US region and pits our Diamond 1, Pesky Bird, aka Rule, against our defending champion 1 player, Goth Duck. Pesky Bird claims they deserve champ because my mechanics are insane, I play free play and freestyle a lot, but I avoid ranked most of the time. I think I can easily take down a champ. So let's see if all that free play is paid off, and which of our birds will end up on the plate whilst the other one flies away victorious. But first, a huge shout out to ExpressVPN. If you've ever wanted to play Sideswipe in a different region, say over with me in Japan, ExpressVPN is how you do it. I can tell you from experience, it 100% works, and honestly, the ping's actually decent too. And right now, every single MOGS viewer is gonna get a huge discount of three months off all 12 month subscriptions. Meaning it just got a whole lot cheaper for you to jump into a different region and destroy your opponents over there. How good is that? So go check out ExpressVPN via the link on screen under the video description. All right, let's go. So first match between Pesky Bird and Goth Duck with uh, our champ on the right. Nice prefix pancake from both players with the diamond taking possession. Little stall play, messed up the last stall though. 
And good block there from Pesky Bird. Nice defense again. Ooh. Very risky. Lots of resets coming up. Pretty much every single 50 so far has had a bit reset. Oh, that was so dangerous. Really well played from Goff Dog. Good defense from Pesky Bird. Stall chain. Beautiful gold shot finish. Nice defense. Man, both of these players very uh, doing very well. Right, Goff Dog taking possession. Nice. That was a weird. That was like a purple ceiling reset with a gold shot. That was really nice from Goff Dog. Another possession play from Pesky Bird. He's just given away possession there with that purple shot. Not recommended. Oh, we've got an opportunity here. Nice ceiling pinch. It's read really easily by Goff Dark. Alright. Both players kind of taking their time here. Feeling each other out. Decent gold shot finish. That was probably the right idea. Goff Dark's showing off his stall chain ability. Ooh, this is dangerous. Oh, he could have really done anything there. Good defense from Pesky Bird. All right, we've got full possession here from Goff Duck. Still zero goals in this match with only five seconds left. The mechanics coming out from Goff Duck. What's he going to do? Can he put this in? He probably can. Wow, that was really close. Ooh, the gold shot there would have been nice. All right, so we're overtime with zero goals apiece. This is, this is a total stalemate. Ooh, this is dangerous. Oh, I feel like Pesky Bird could easily win this. Goff Duck with possession. No, he's done nothing with it. Both players are playing really, really safe. Oh, I, I don't know how that happened. That was so unlucky. I don't know what happened there. There was a bit of lag. I thought Pesky Bird was going to push it over his head, but yeah, Goff Duck came out with it. Good win. That was a total stalemate for the entire game. Goff Duck pulling out the win right at the end. Good job. All right, let's move on to match two. I feel like this could go either way. All right, match number two, kickoff one, and our champion one matchup. We've got preflip pancakes again from both players. And Pesky Bird again taking possession. Nice gold shot finish, just giving away possession though. Ooh, bit of an overcommit there from our champ, and Pesky Bird has capitalized hard. Good goal. Ooh, this could be dangerous. Great defense. Pesky Bird's defense is really good. Particularly for a Diamond 1, he's done really well. Maybe clear up the back wall. That was really dangerous. Goff Duck has... He thought he had an opportunity, but overcommitted hard. Pesky Bird hasn't capitalized. Unlucky. Good defense again. Gold shot at the end. Yo, yeah, oh, he needed an earlier gold shot than that. Good defense from Goff Duck. Ooh, yep, that was so risky again. I feel like Pesky Bird has to stop clearing it across his goal like that. Early red shot. Can Goff Duck put this in? He probably can. Lovely. So we got the equalizer with one minute to go. Good defense from Pesky Bird. Oh, Goff Duck's almost put that in. That was so close. Pesky Bird could easily... No, he's not gonna. Damn, if he'd got the reset there earlier, could have been a really nice goal. <laughs> Goff Duck with the stall chains. Can he score from this one? No, he can't. Good defense again from Pesky Bird. Those stall chains are really not doing much for Goff Duck. All right, Pesky Bird, don't clear this up your back wall, Bo. Don't do it. Oh, no, Goff Duck has capitalized hard on that. Yeah, as I said, you really should not clear the ball the same way every time. Pesky Bird's got to learn from that mistake. Oh, Goff Duck's almost won the kickoff. Can he get a gold shot? Oh, that was so close. Right, Goff Duck taking possession again with some stall chains. Oh, this is so close. Only one goal in it. We've got a 50 right in front of goal. Five seconds left. Can Goff Duck hold on? Stall chain. Oh, that's really dangerous. And that should be it if, <laughs> if I think it hit the ground. Pesky Bird with an opportunity. Very close. Oh my god, he's actually scored it. Beautiful. So we got the equalizer, and we're going to go straight to overtime. Whoever gets the next goal will win the match, and maybe the series, if it's Goff Dark. All right, dead ball kickoff. Pesky Bird taking possession. Ooh, very tense play from both players. That could have easily gone over Goff Dark's head. Stall chain. Can he put it in? He might be able to, he can, beautiful, and there's the winner from Goff Duck, so our champion taking the victory in straight sets, great performance from both players, Pesky Bird's defense really good, made a few mistakes there, I think he gives away possession a little bit too much, but unfortunately again, the diamond in this case does not deserve champ. 
GG from both players and good win from Goff Dark. Our third matchup is another one in the US region and is between Cool Penguin and SQ Happy. Penguin is a Diamond 1 who thinks they deserve champ because I'm Diamond 1 but I beat GC in competitive 1v1s. Well, you know, beating 1GC doesn't make you a champ, or maybe it does. Let's find out. Alright, let's go. So, the matchup between SQ Happy and Cool Penguin. So, we got our Diamond on the right, champ on the left. Nice gold shot kickoff there from Happy. And Penguin in possession. Nice safe play there. Okay, he's given away possession there with the purple, but it was an okay play. Ooh, this could, yeah, could have easily been a goal. Penguin on the defense. We got possession from Happy. Stall chain coming out. Gold shot early. Gold shot beautiful. Nice defense from Penguin. And pretty tame shot there. Ooh, Happy's done really well to get that gold shot over Penguin. Lovely first goal. Right, so we're one goal up with just 40 seconds gone. Our champ in the lead. Offensive pancake from both players. Ooh, this is dangerous. Nice gold shot from Happy. Very nice. That's the second goal he's got so far with a gold shot. The gold shot's proving to be really effective. Here's our third kickoff. We've got fakes from both players. Oh, Penguin's charged into that. Oh, another almost gold shot goal there from, from Happy. We've got a possession play here from Penguin. He's done pretty well. Wow, very nice. Did not expect that. Penguin's done really well to not take the shot and just to drive the ball straight into the goal. Such a nice play there. An interesting kickoff. Ooh, nice early gold shot attempt from Penguin. This is probably going to be Yen. Yes, it will. Unlucky there, but really nice play from Happy. All right, so half of the match gone, and we've already had four goals with a two-goal lead from our champ. Nice safe kickoff there from both players. Happy's messed up his stall. Penguin, if he can get a reset, he can. Oh, he's almost there. No, that was so close. I think he was probably low boost again. Oh, unlucky there from, from... Oh my god, beautiful! What was that? That was like a that was a gold ground pinch. Really nice from Happy. Beautiful use of the gold shot there. Offensive pancake from both players. This could be another gold shot attempt. Unlucky not to score that. Oh, that's a beautiful gold shot from Penguin. So nice. I mean, every single goal so far has been gold shots, I think. Except maybe that one from Penguin. Anyway, really nice to see the gold shots coming out. Really effective. And could have one more goal. No, nope, Penguin saved it. And SQ Zappy's almost put that in. That was so close. All right, that should do it. So 4-2. Our champ wins by a decent margin. Really entertaining game though. I'm looking forward to game two. All right, game number two between Happy and Penguin. So our champ currently one match up. If he wins this, oh, this could be an early goal. Yes, it is. OG there from Penguin. Really nice kickoff there with the gold shot from Happy. Penguin taking possession, giving away possession though. Messed up his stall. Ooh, this is dangerous. Silly pinch, and it's in. Lovely. Another dead ball situation here, and Penguin taking possession. Didn't get a reset. He did get a reset there. Wow, that was close. Nice gold shot to keep the ball away from Happy. Penguin should take this slow. He really needs a goal. Does not want to concede again. Both players playing pretty cautiously at the moment. SQ Happy doing really well to defend. Penguin just cannot find a gap. Ooh, nice gold shot attempt. Another gold shot, maybe? Nope. Ooh, Penguin's got possession here. Happy's done really well to defend that. Another gold shot, early gold shot, beautiful. All right, so we got overtime now and uh, just one goal in it. One goal, it will seal the deal. Ooh, unlucky. This could be dangerous. No. Nope. Penguin with the early shot. SQ Happy taking possession. Another gold shot finish. Oh, I'm lucky not to score that. Beautiful gold, beautiful stole to goal there. That was so nice. What a finish from Happy and what a way to win the match. Another gold shot coming out from him. So many gold shots this series. That was a really great win from Happy. Great performance from both players. Unfortunately, again, our diamond does not deserve champ, but he did put up a good fight. And our fourth and final matchup for this video is in the EU region and is between Octane, otherwise known as Zogs, and Stormix, our defending champ one player. 
Sogs thinks they deserve champ because I have defeated countless season 6 GCs, so a champ should be quite easy. Well, whilst it is good to see that kind of confidence, let's see if it's justified or if it's just typical diamond arrogance. Alright, so game one between Octane aka Zogs and Stormix. So our diamond on the left. Prefit Panic Kick, I think, from both players. Let's clear up the back wall from Octane. Ooh, stall chain from Stormix. This could be dangerous. He's done well to defend that. Ooh, tense situation here on the back wall. Oh, lovely from Octane. That's really nice. Stall chain. Oh, nice stall chain from Octane. He's done well there. Doesn't have a flip, though. Nice clear. For oh, beautiful fast aerial flip reset from Octane. He's done well. Oh, he's almost put that in. That was so close. Nice and lucky defense from Stormix. Oh, and Octane can put it in. Lovely. So we got the first goal coming from our Diamond. This is going to be interesting. Good to see the heart from Octane. And number two kickoff. Very safe kickoff from both. Octane not done well, though. And that could be a goal. No, very unlucky not to score that. Nice stall chain. Going the wrong way, though. But good to see those mechanics coming out. Again, going the wrong way. That's a nice... They're nice mechanics, but they're not doing much. Oh, he's actually put it in. Beautiful. Lovely play. I feel like Octane got really lucky there, but his mechanics are very nice. Number three kickoff, and we've got, the diamond is up by two goals. Very rare to see that. Both players are doing really well. I feel like the Octane definitely has the advantage at the moment. Both in the score and just the overall play. Maybe our champ a little bit nervous to defend. He's Oh my god, that was the closest OG I've ever seen. Very nervous play here from our champ, and he's put it in beautifully. Wow, that was going against the runner play. Nice goal there. Can he get the equalizer, though? That's the question. Kickoff number four, and got a nice even kickoff there from both players. Some more stalls coming out, but again going the wrong way. This could be the equalizer. Unlucky. Goal try going the wrong way, and this should be the winner. Ain't no way. Yeah, that was a, that was a very unfortunate goal there. Oh, this could be another goal. How, how diamond turtling. Is that intentional? That was very showy. Ooh, nice late shot there from Stormix. And he's got six seconds left to get the equalizer. It is possible. Can he pull it off? Ooh, that was a very nervous kickoff from Octane. And he's done very well to clear that. And that's going to be a, another goal to seal the deal. Great win there from our diamond. 4-2. And that'll do it. So beautiful win. First game goes to our diamond. And now let's move on to game two. This could go either way. So our diamond is currently one match up. So if he wins this, he will win the series and will deserve champ. Oh, nice early goal there from Octane. Wow. So he's gotten the first goal again. Is this game going to go to him? And is he going to actually deserve champ? Kickoff number two, and wow, we got another goal from Octane. Beautiful. That was a kind of weird kickoff from both players. Don't know what was happening there, but he somehow pulled a goal out of it. Prefit Pancake. Oh, that could be, yep, that's another goal. Wow, three really quick goals. Only nine seconds gone in the game. We've already had three goals. Kickoff number four. Nice even kickoff. Stomach's taking possession. He's wasted a lot of boost there. And back wall clear from Octane. Stomix could put this in. Easy double tap. Yes, it's in. There's the equalizer. Only 20 seconds gone. Already four goals. What is going on? All right, let's have a look at this kickoff. Maybe some fakes. Yeah, Octane's done well to fake that. Oh, that could have easily been a goal from our champ. Back wall clear. Nice and safe. Oh, that could be in. Very close. Oh, can Octane clear this? Yes, he can. He's done well. Stormix keeping possession on the, in the corner there. Ooh, that would have been dangerous. I thought he was going to go up the back wall. That would have been absolute suicide. And Octane doing well to clear that. He could get another goal here. That will be the winner if he does. Oh, this could be in by... Oh my god, that was close. Stormix could have easily put that in. Don't know what happened, but... Was a tight situation. That's a yep. That's gonna give Stormix the lead. Oh, I messed up another stall. It could be dangerous. I'm lucky not to score that. Not as many mechanics coming out from Octane, but I feel like he does have. Oh, 
Oh, and he's conceded another goal. Now a two-goal lead from StormX. So this might... This looks like it's going to our champ this game. So we may go to a best of three. Oh, that's really dangerous. Oh, it could have easily been in from Octane. Oh, that's probably not going to be in. Only 14 seconds left. 12 seconds left. Octane needs two goals here. Don't think he's going to get them. There's the countdown. And I think that's going to be it. We might get a consolation goal. Nope, not even a consolation. All right, GG. So that's the second game goes to our champs. And now we're one game apiece. This is going to be really exciting to see who wins the decider. Will it be our diamond or will it be our champ? All right, game number three, the decider between Octane, aka Zogs, and Stormix. Prefit Pancake from Stormix. And Octane taking possession. Nice gold shot. Gave away possession, though. Ooh, nice safe play from Octane. Stormix taking possession. Messed up his soul again. That seems to happen a lot to him. Ooh, this could be dangerous. Nope, Stormix taking the safe option. Another messed up soul from Octane. I feel like both of these guys need to practice their stalls a little bit more. Oh, nice play there. Follow through gold shot. Stall to follow the gold shot from Octane. That was really nice. And we skipped forward a bit. I think that was a bit of a bug in the recording. Oh, nice clear from Octane. <laughs> nice communication between the players. No toxicity at all. It's good to see. Back wall clear from Octane. Can he get a nice stall chain going? Oh, that might go over Stormix. Is that it? Well, lovely goal there from Octane. So one goal lead from our diamond. Great to see. He may actually be able to win this. Only a minute left. Oh, a very messed up clear there from Octane. Stormix is going to OG though. Unlucky. Don't know how that went in. A bit of a misplay, I think, for both players. All right, kickoff number three. We've got a two-goal lead from our diamond. Nice safe kickoff there from Octane. Can he defend this? He can. Oh, a bit of an overcommit, but he's done well to keep possession. Yeah, this is a good idea. Time wasting is definitely in his best interest at the moment. Oh, nice goal shot over Stormix's head. That could have been a goal. Very close. Stormix could put this in. No, he's messed up his goal shot. Stormix with the stall chain. Hasn't come off, though. Ooh, this could be dangerous. Very nice stall chain from both of them. One in offense and the other in defense. Another messed up stall chain, but Octane's kept possession. This is going to... And he's got the winner. That's three goals. There's absolutely no way Stormix is coming back now. That's it. Octane, aka Zogs, 100% deserves champ. What a great diamond player. He's done so well to win that. There's no... Okay, Stormix has got the constellation. So that's 3-1. Two games to Octane, our diamond, and one game to Stormix. What a performance. We'll have the last kickoff now, and Octane's going to put that down onto the ground. Is he going to get another goal? No, he's not. Maybe another constellation from Stormix. And that should touch the ground. So Octane keeping it up. He wants another goal. Stormix going to clear it, maybe. Just put it down onto the ground. You want another constellation? Okay, that's going to hit the ground. GG's. Octane, aka Zog's done so well to win that. There is absolutely no doubt at all. Our diamond definitely deserves champ. Well played from both players, especially our diamond, and congratulations, bro. And with that awesome result, that concludes episode 2 of Sides by Players vs. the rank they think they deserve, Diamonds vs. Champs. If you want to participate in future episodes of this series, come join the Mog's Discord server and put your entry in the You vs. Rank You Deserve channel. All you need to do is say your current rank in 1v1s, the region you play in, the rank you think you deserve, and why you think you deserve it and then you'll be considered for participation in a future episode. Thank you so much to everyone who participated in this video, and congratulations to all of our players who were able to win their matches, especially Octane, aka Zogs, who was able to defeat his champ and prove that he really does deserve champion. Congratulations, dude. And like the video if you liked it, dislike it if not, subscribe for more videos like this, as well as a whole bunch of other Sideswipe content. As always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video.